hello guys in this video i will show you how to make video in the ufn as you can see i have the video of me liking the map and as you can see this video in the map let's jump into ufn and i will show you how you can make it too okay so first thing you should do is right here in this website the link will be in the description just click on choose file and select the file you want to convert to and after this you should click on upload the video and click on convert to G gpg gpg but before you do it make sure that your video is under 30 seconds and select the fps for your type for your video so if your video is 20 seconds long you should you should use this one if you have uh, under 10 seconds you should use this one and if you have under 30 seconds you can use i will select this and then click convert uh, to gpg and then just click download range as a zip Okay, so first thing you should do is download a texture packer and when you download it, you should click on use free version. Right here, you should add sprites and open folder with your frames and then select the first one and click shift on your keyboard and select the last one to save. Uh, to select all of them and then click open. Okay, so I uh, right here, you should disable features and ignore in this project. So as you can see, okay so for, uh, right now the first thing you should do right here you should select all of them and change the settings to eight to eight thousand fourteen and as you can see by the way uh when you select like when you select the thing uh you can see this white square and you need to have all of your images in this white square so thing you should do is click on uh one thing uh one of these images and then uh select all of them and right here you should you should change the scale to uh, 0 0.6 or something like that and uh, uh, as you can see i have all of them uh, in my sheet so you should uh publish this sprite sheet uh and yeah publish this sprite sheet Okay, so now la launch UFN and go to your content drawer and import your texture. So import your texture and count the rows and columns. So then save it and go to your mat make new material, make new texture and connect your sprite uh, texture. Then add flipbook and connect the animation phase to time. Uh, divided by value, uh, then number of rows. I have ten, 10 of them. Well, then number of call. Then click apply, and then just drag your uh, material uh, on the asset you want to change. That, for example, you can even make it for uh, the board.